Autodesk has an app store. It's called Autodesk Exchange Apps. Now this isn't a new feature. It's been around for a couple of releases now, but AutoCAD 2014 does enhance how you can manage those apps. One of the nice things about the Autodesk Exchange Apps program is that when you log in with your Autodesk 360 account to the Autodesk Exchange App Store, you get those apps. So if you log in to Exchange, like I am now, and then you go to another computer and log in, you still have access to the apps that you've purchased. Now that's great. AutoCAD 2014 will give you several tools that are very valuable to help you manage your Autodesk Exchange apps. There are two different ribbon tabs that you will be able to use. One is the Featured Apps tab. Click it here. Click on the Connect to Exchange button right here. That will open up your default browser and take you right to the Autodesk Exchange apps and it will take you to the AutoCAD store since it is in AutoCAD. Now Autodesk does have stores for some of their other products and you can surf to those just right here. So if you use something else besides AutoCAD like Civil 3D or any of these other options here, Autodesk 3ds Max for example, you can get to those stores just by clicking on the appropriate button. But these are all of the apps that are in this Exchange app store. You have some featured apps right here and some of the most downloaded. And these lists will vary from time to time depending on what's being downloaded often and what Autodesk has chosen to feature. If we go back to AutoCAD, we can get to those featured apps right here. Not all of them are listed as you just saw, but several of them will be. So check this from time to time because you might find something that could interest you or that might be something that you could even use, like a dynamic block remover. That's something that might be helpful. If you like any of these apps, you can just click on one of them and it will take you to the Autodesk Exchange app store for that particular app. It will give you information about it and if you want to purchase it. Remember, once you purchase an app through your account, you'll need to sign in first, of course. And once you do, that app is yours, regardless of what machine you put it on. And that's a great feature to have. So you can see these featured apps here. You can connect to the Exchange Store there as well. Now, any of the apps that you've installed onto your workstation, you can get to by clicking on the Plugins ribbon tab right here. And these are the apps that you have. Of course, this is the Exchange App Manager, which is really cool. And that comes default with this version of AutoCAD. It tells you what apps you've loaded, the company you got them from, when they were installed, their size, and if there is a status update. And if there is, you can just click on here and follow the on-screen instructions and your app will automatically be updated. So getting to the App Store is much easier and you have tools built in now that can help you manage those apps and it simplifies things.